Um, we had a shooting last night at 908 North Franklin, right up the road here at the Lit Martini Lounge. Lit Cigar and Martini Lounge, 908 North Franklin. Um, according to witnesses out here at the scene, about 3 o'clock in the morning, right as the bar was closing, a large fight broke out inside the bar. Suspect left the bar, apparently armed himself, came back, the fight ended up um, spilling out into the streets, and we have seven people shot outside last night, one of them fatally. The deceased victim is a resident of California who was here visiting the area for a wedding. The other six people are in stable condition at multiple Tampa Bay Area hospitals. We're currently working with witnesses to develop leads. We have not made any arrests as of yet, but again, we are working with an extreme sense of urgency on this, and we're not going to sleep until we have something concrete to put these uh, violent criminals where they belong. Um, the suspects clearly have a disregard for human life. They opened fire into a crowd of people that weren't doing anything more than just celebrating right out here on Franklin Street. So it's a disturbing set of circumstances. Um, I don't have a lot of details, unfortunately, but I felt it was important for the people in the downtown area to know that there is no imminent threat of danger right now. This was an isolated fight that happened in the bar. There are people... Um, at local area hospitals, there was one deceased, one fatality, and again, we're working on leads as quickly as we can to identify who was responsible for this. Right now, we have one that we know of, but there may be two. We're not, I, I don't have those exact details. I wish I had more for you, but I don't. You don't have those, like, one or multiple shooters? I don't. And you said the people visiting were in town for a wedding? Yes. Yes, the deceased is from California, who was in town with several friends for a wedding. In the altercation, we're still working through that. But we believe it was two groups of people that got involved in some kind of an altercation. You know, 3 o'clock in the morning, alcohol and guns are not a good combination whatsoever. But again, we're working as, as quickly as we can to identify leads. I just want the public to know that there's no imminent threat. We are, we, the scene is secure. You know, we are working through leads tirelessly. So if we see a lot of police activity downtown, it is related to that. But there's, you know, we're, we're going to get that under control. I don't. Last question? Thank you. Thank you.